Once upon a time, there was a little girl named Emily who lived with her father in a beautiful village. Her father was an old farmer who worked all the day. Emily is used to go with him since her childhood. When he is doing his work Emily chase the butterflies, play with tinny animals, pick up the flowers and dance. She loved spending time in the forest near by the crops in which his father works. Every day, she would go into the woods to watch the butterflies. She was fascinated by their colorful wings and graceful movements. Emily would often sit quietly for hours, watching the butterflies as they danced around the flowers. She spent her days trying to watch and catch a butterfly, but they were too quick for her. One morning, when his father was doing his work Emily saw a beautiful butterfly. The butterfly was sitting on a flower and she saw the butterfly want to fly but there were thrones on the bud of flower and the wing of butterfly is injured from corner. Emily touched the butterfly wing silently and took it in her hand carefully because the butterfly is soft and delicate creature. She made a cozy home for the butterfly and tended to its needs, feeding it nectar from the flowers in her garden. After few days, the butterfly's wing healed, and she was ready to fly again. Emily knew it was time to let the butterfly go, but she was sad to see it leave. She carefully picked it up and brought it back to her home. She helped her to fly high in the sky. The butterfly flew away and Emily chased the butterfly and go deeper in the woods. Suddenly she realized she has lost her way. She had no clue to way back to home because she was a little girl. She was sitting there quietly with a sad face. She was afraid and want to go back but she can't remember her way. Then she hears heavy voice in the forest. Hello little girl. Why are you still here? Just go back to your home and play there. In few hours the sun will be dropped and it will be dark there. The girl replied in a sad voice. I lost my way while chasing the butterfly and my father doesn't know where I'm. The voice said. Ooh my poor girl. I noticed your love for the butterflies. Now I'm going to tell you one secret. The butterflies are magical creatures that could grant wishes to those who treated them with kindness and love. This butterfly will help you to find your way back to home because you helped her. Till then just sit there and wait for her. She was waiting for the butterfly and fall asleep there. When she woke up she seems darkness of night everywhere. But there were a group of butterflies nearby her. She was amazed. She never had experience to watch this much butterflies. She saw a wave of light coming behind a tree when she moved forward she was shocked. There were butterflies with lights seems like enchanted butterflies. They were everywhere. She forgot her problem and moved further in forest. It was a magical experience for her. Beautiful butterflies seem like fairies were dancing in the forest. Whole forest was glowing in the beauty of them. Meanwhile she again saw that butterfly. Emily's eyes filled with excitement and hoped to see her again. She became happy to saw her with her family. That butterfly was fluttering around her because Emily helped her otherwise she was not able to meet with her group. She asked Emily why are you still there? You should be at your home yet. Emily replied sadly that. She was chasing her and lost her way. She told her that her father must be worried. Butterfly said, let's go I can help you to go home safely. Firstly, I'm going to take you to my homeland. You will be happy to see this magical land and you never had such an amazing experience before. Emily was happy. Then she follow her and go to her magical place. There were many groups of butterflies they all are fluttering around her. The butterfly and Emily becomes good friends. They took her to her home. On the edge of the forest they flew around her for a moment, as if to say goodbye, and then flew away. Her father and the whole village people saw that beautiful scene and witnessed that the butterflies take her toward her village. The next second, father saw the Emily and hugged her having tears in his eyes and said. I thought I had lost you. 
my little girl. After that Emily went back to home with her father. From that day on, Emily known as the butterfly girl. The butterflies would always greet her when she came to the forest, and they would follow her as she walked through the woods. Emily felt like she had a special connection with the butterflies, and she loved spending time with them. As she grew up she realized that her wish had come true. Butterflies started to land on her and fly around her whenever she goes there. Emily went back to the forest to watch the butterflies again. She visit that place on and off to see that scene again. But now she know her way back to home. For Emily it was magical day she always remember that day. Every night she dreamt about them. And wish to see that magical place again.